Welcome back to the Beaufort News. With me now is Larry Marks, and he is the owner of FWDG, which is a fabulous furniture store in Beaufort, of course, and he just celebrated a milestone birthday. So thank you for joining us. We have some exciting news around that birthday, and that is the fact that you are giving back to the community as your birthday gift to them. So tell us a little bit about that. Well, uh, our family really celebrates birthdays, and I wanted to celebrate um, this milestone birthday, turning 70. Yeah. Um, and we, um, my wife and I have some pet charities and nonprofits that we always donate to and participate with. And um, our store just finished um, our best year ever on September 30th. So we um, decided to ask staff um, at the store what their pet charities were, and they came up with a large number of them, nearly 30 charities right. that, um, that uh, they um, said they would like to, to um, receive a donation. So we had an event for my 70th birthday. It was a 70s themed birthday. So uh, I was dressed in a pretty hideous costume <laughs> and um, others as well, uh, but it was a lot of fun. And it was, um, the people there were um, mostly the recipients and family and FWDG family and um, some manufacturers reps that had donated some some products as well for us to give away. And um, so we had a big time. We gave away almost $30,000 to these various charities and it just made us feel really good. Um, well, so that's that was the event. That was the reason for it. Um, and it was wildly successful. It, well, it certainly was. That is a that is an impressive number, and it's also really an impressive amount of charities that you were able to help out a little bit that way. And I know that you really do have a history, though, of giving back to the community. You have your coat drive every year. You do other things. So tell us a little bit about the philosophy of giving back. Well, when when things are going well, um, you want to be able to share those things, and in 1990 at that time we had had um, a very great year and we did a little planning and my wife Robin came up with the idea of the FWDG coat drive and so in 1990 that was our first one and we thought it would probably be a one-off um, that we would do it and it would be done and we would feel good about it and all but it was so successful that we continued to have it each year and um, we've now given away almost 46,000, or received and, and uh, delivered almost 46,000 garments. Um, so it, it's been, been crazy good. Uh, we run it um, from November 1 to uh, December 31. And it, um, the biggest question I get asked every year around this time is when does coat drive start? And I've got a number of friends who've already contacted me and said, are you ready to start receiving? And, and we don't. We, we try to hold off until November 1 because it does take up space. And yeah. uh, the agencies that we give it to, give the coats to, are not prepared to hang on to coats for a long period of time. So yeah. we started in November and as soon as we get an accumulation, we deliver to uh, either the Deepwell um, Project or Help of Beaufort. Um, are the two major recipients. And we always get a number of children's clothes, which makes us feel good because there are a lot of kids in the, in the communities that do yeah. not have um, warm uh, clothing. So yeah. that's, that's great. And it's just been, you know, it just makes us feel good. Absolutely. Well, and again, very impressive numbers, 46,000 coats. That's amazing. So make sure that you're donating yours starting in November. And we've got, you know, just about 30 seconds left, but I know you have a big anniversary coming up as well. So tell us what the plans are for that. Well, we, our 50th anniversary, I started this business uh, with help from my, my father, my parents, um, when I was 20 years old. And so January marks our, our 50th year. Um, and we are uh, going to have um, some, some really neat things going on, some, some new vendors that we'll be adding, some uh, updating of our website, and lots of other things that will be fun, but for precise information, you need to check back with us. Oh, that, well, that sounds good. <laughs> that sounds very good. Well, thank you, Larry, for being here today. Happy birthday again, and well, thank you for you. all that you do in the community, and congratulations on 50 years. Well, thank you so much. 
A big thank you to all of our guests. Our team behind the scenes, WHHI General Manager Jessa Jeremiah, Communications Manager Latia Nelson, and Production Assistant Joseph Keith, and most of all to you, our viewers, for watching. That's the way it is this week in our Low Country Gem of the South. I'm Betsy McDaniel. Robin Zimmerman will be back next week, and thank you for joining us for the Beaufort News.